everybody welcome to chemistry concept and today we'll be discussing about the admission procedure in university of delhi in ug courses so there are two way to get admission in uc first is based on your merit or your marks in uc uh, 12th class and another is based on the entrance examination and for merit based the registration portal is open already open your study already open at 6 pm and for entrance exam based admission the registration will be starting from 31st of may so right now i am telling about the merit based admission registration criteria and the steps for first step what you have to do you have to open this web link open this web link you will see this window this window here you have to register yourself as a new registration just click here you will see one window this kind of window in this window you have to put your name here your middle name surname suppose your name is rahul kumar saini so this is your first name and this is your middle name and this is your surname like this you have to fill all those column here and put email here one more important thing i'll tell you this email will be you have to keep it very secure until your admission is not done because every information contact everything will be done by this email id only and you have to fill all this column here and all these columns are mandatory and after filling all this you have to put captcha here and after that you just click here register after this you will see one window this kind of window you will be appear there this means your registration is successful after that you will get one link in your email and you have to click on that link after that you again come to this first web page of university of delhi ug courses and you put just your email uh, registered email id and password and put this captcha here and then click on login after that you will see this kind of window here after that you have to click on apply after this you will get one this window where is there is nine steps you have to follow for that and one by one you have to fill this is all those steps and first of all the step is for personal details you have to put your personal details your name you can change it here after that you can't change your name not, and email id is already registered so you cannot change your email id now so you have to put your details here aadhar card detail is not mandatory you can put it or not that's depend on you and one by one put all those details in personal detail after that there is a section of academics detail in academic detail what you have to do you have to put your board here board roll number passing year result status and the language of medium suppose you belong to hindi medium you put here hindi you belongs to english medium you put english here and there is subject and maximum marks and marks obtained if your result is already out what you have to do you have to click here subject will be shown here Sub select the subject put the marks of uh, maximum marks and max obtained for all of the subjects and put here the total marks and marks obtained here and after that your third menu is for the course selection for that we'll see there will be lots of courses will be given here you can select any course based on your choice and your expected marks so i'll tell you uh, based on your marks only will get your courses so suppose you belongs to uh, medical or non medical you can fill any courses whatever you want but depending on your uh, eligibility criteria only they will provide you the uh, the courses and one more thing if you want to do this course chemistry honors the needed subject is physics chemistry math suppose you belongs to physics chemistry biology you cannot go for chemistry honors this is not possible in the university of delhi so don't forget forget these things and uh, select your courses here after that you will see there is two section sports and eca these are quota based suppose you having some quota like sports quota then you can use your sports quota in the admission here so you have to put your the tournament name a competition level and the date of certificate and the type of the certificate you have to put here and then you click here and submit and uh, one more thing that if you belongs to a sports quota then you have to pay 100 rupees extra in the registration 
and if you having ECA certificates and this is also one quota uh, these four types of quota is given here based on your cultural activities and if you having some EC quota you can put it here and click on submit and one more thing you have to pay again 100 rupees extra you if you belongs to ECA quota and then you have to fill this uh, bank detail and then update it this you can fill after this section also no problem and so in next section what you have to do you have to upload your documents the first is the photo you have to upload a photo size is between 20 to 50 kv in jpg format you have to upload it here then you have to upload the signature the side is 20 to 50 kb in G jpg format so this both is in jpg format next is self attested 10th class certificate you have to apply uh, upload here and that is from 75 to 150 kb in pdf or jpg whatever you want you can upload it here and next is plus two mark sheet and uh, that is also in pdf and jpg you can upload it here and the category certificate you have to upload it here uh, that is also in 75 to 150 kb then you have to upload it here the physically handicapped certificate here and that should be in jpg or in pdf format anything is acceptable after that what you have to do after that you have to click on the preview section just filling all those details you go to preview section you will see whatever form you have filled and you can check whether your form is correct or not if something is modification is needed just modify it then go for payment section just do payment section and finish the, your registration is finished now you, you are eligible for the UG courses admission and if you having any problem any technical queries please send your email to this email id and contact them these are the official email id given by the du and if you have any grievance so please do grievance here that section will be given here and you can put your grievance here if you have any doubt any question please contact us and contact the email you can put your comment in comment box also if you belong to physically handicapped there is two groups have been made one is in north campus another is in south campus they will take care of your online admission pro criteria everything so contact this also thank you